All right, everybody, we're back. The content gods have blessed me with free money. My son will be thanking you <laughs> because, uh, you know, diapers are expensive. And if there's one thing that is basically guaranteed free money for me, it's new metal. So we're back. The people over at React have blessed us with Gen Z reacting to new metal. Let's check it out. I've not watched this. I hope that my man Lucas is back. I hope Gavin is back, but we'll see who they picked this time and we shall see what Gen Z knows about new metal. Don't you guys just hate it when you try so hard and you get so far, but in the end, it, it doesn't even matter. matter. Oh, Jackson, Jackson knew. Jackson is Mr. Enthusiasm. He couldn't wait to show dad. He's like, oh dad, I know that song. I know that song. I was put my arm around. Jackson, listen, we talked about this. Let's just, you're at like a, a level eight enthusiasm now. I'd like you to bring it down to like a level four. Let's just, let's not try so hard, huh buddy? How about that? That's right. Today we're going to see if Gen Z knows 90s new metal. Now we're going to watch a bunch of new metal videos and you guys. Oh, we got to see the producer. Hmm. Well, I can see now this guy looks like he would be a 2024 new metal fan. So now it's all starting to make more sense. Let me know if you like it, you don't like it, or you don't even know what the heck is going on. Okay. Most likely. Okay. Weird. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's. Yeah. So I'll play a video and you guys have to give me the name of the band and you have to give me the name oh of the song. My. Headphones on. Okay. Oh gosh. I hope they have the title in the song. Here we go. Okay, so first up, we got some Linkin Park. I love this video because it looks like a cutscene from Morrowind, right? I expect to see Silt Striders walking around in the back. <laughs> and then, of course, you'll get killed with, like, two hits from one of those goddamn mosquito things. Uh, <laughs> shout out to the team at Morrowind for putting together this amazing video. Yeah, the best that 3D Studio Max... God, that 3D Studio Max look is... Is like just it's so easy to see isn't it okay, okay music video is cool yeah. oh. <laughs> will eventually be a memory every time Ooh, he knows he knows so too hard. It gets oh. so hard. that's what you just said <laughs> <sighs> jackson uh Jackson is like 23 going on 40 and it's just, I just, oh. Jackson, trust me, you're going to get old before you know it. You don't need to like speed run becoming a new metal boomer. That's my advice. In the air. <laughs> even... He, this guy looks like, uh, what's his name? Justin, the singer of Tala kind of looks like him, doesn't it? So you guys do know the lyrics. You guys are okay. singing along. So they all, they all know the song. See, everybody loves Linkin Park. Everybody loves Linkin Park. Great band. Along to that song, but you don't yeah. know what new metal is? No. How'd you guys feel about that? I loved it. Yes. Oh, that was. Oh. Can you guys mm. give me the name She's of that band? She's into it. Is that Linkin Park? That's Linkin. What is that? <laughs> I like this button. I want this react button right here. I feel like that was like the most underwhelming sound. Like I expected like, you know, on the real estate shows when they when they sell a house, you know, they've got the bell and they go like ring the bell and say gang, 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 gang. And it like wakes everybody up for like half a block around. This was like the most underwhelming like button sound I've ever heard. Is that Lincoln? Bing. Park? That's Lincoln Park. Oh my, that's the oh. only one I'm getting. Okay, <laughs> You're she knows. This whole video, no. Lincoln Park. Lincoln mm -hmm. Park. Lincoln Park. Okay. Oh, <laughs> Lincoln Park. And what's the name of the song? Oh, they got two and different react buttons. In the end. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we know new <laughs> metal. Okay, they're so excited. They're so excited. But here's uh, here's something to consider. Okay, Gen Z are no longer like the young people, like the oldest people in Gen Z now are like, what, 26, 27? Gen Z people, they're not kids anymore. They're like young adults. So I feel like we've got to move on from this format now. We've got to get some Gen Alpha in there soon. My son is on the very youngest side of Gen Alpha. He can't talk yet, but if you would like my son to react to uh, Rage Against the Machine. You let me know because uh, Gen Z is getting too old now to play kids. It's a fact. What do you associate this song with? I associate Linkin Park with like scene kids with like that hair, like yeah. the- uh, <sighs> Jackson, come on, come on. If you're gonna be born in the wrong generation, you can't, uh, come on, Jackson. Linkin Park and scene kids. I feel like, uh, as your father, I feel like you deserve a spanking for this. That's right. Is he going to call it Screamo? He needs a spanking. Jackson, you're grounded. No more iPad for you.
I'm thinking of like seen girls where they have that that hair swoop over the eye. Oh, the little bird's nest thing going yeah, on. Yeah, that or like Anthony Padilla, like early Smosh. Yes, oh, oh yes. yeah. Early Smosh people love Linkin Park. <laughs> <laughs> it, it is a confirmed fact. Where have you guys heard of Linkin Park before? Where have you guys heard the song? I feel like I, I'm, I'm interested. Where do they know Linkin Park from? Let's see. I think it's giving Transformers. It oh, is a Transformers. Transformers. Yeah. Okay. Linkin Park makes all the Transformers music. Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah. Good. That was like original. Transformers. Yeah. yeah. Well, Linkin Park is the Transformers theme song. They do all. <laughs> I love the rage bait in these videos. I want to know how many new metal dads are like furious. Like, no, they're not the Transformers band. New metal was the defining music. They were anthems for my generation. They took the words out of my soul and they put them onto the radio. How dare you call them the Transformers band? Ugh! All the Transformers mm -hmm. songs. Okay. Yeah. So <laughs> out of all the albums that have gone gold, Platinum, multi-platinum, only 92 albums have ever gone diamond, and Linkin Park's debut album went diamond, Hybrid Theory. Wow. Mm. Oh my All right. God. I like this. She's, <laughs> this is what happens like, when some like metal nerd, like, like mansplains some stupid trivia to a girl, and because she's a nice person, she pretends to be interested, and he's like so proud of himself because he just made this girl aware of some very important metal trivia. Only 92 albums have ever gone diamond, and Linkin Park's debut album went diamond, Hybrid Theory. Wow. Oh my <laughs> That's like when you come home from school and you're in second grade with some really interesting fact about insects to your mom. You know, like, mom, did you know that insects have a thorax, a cephalothorax, and an abdomen? They have three body segments. That is a true bug has three body segments, mom. She's like, oh, wow, that's great, sweetie. That's great. Okay, now um, take off your shoes, please. All right, the phone's on. Go all right. Uh, first of all, I love that they called Rage Against the Machine new metal because we just know how enraged uh, Tom Morello would be to get lumped in with Limp Biscuit and any other new metal band. So hats off for that. I hope that they include like Panic at the Disco or I don't know um, <laughs> Machine Head. Oh, I hope they have one of the Machine Head new metals. <gasps> oh, I'm dying of cringe. You know, if, if they make Narcan for cringe, I need that. You know, so like if, if you see some like junkie passed out in the street, you know, you just pull the Narcan out of your purse, you give them a little zap and they're like, oh, I'm back. I feel like I'm about to overdose from cringe from these kids rapping along to Rage Against the Machine. I need someone to give me a little Narcan cringe uh, shot in the nose. Ooh, chosen wife? I'm so confused. Chosen wife? Chosen wife. Much. That's, that was sick. That's good. That was that's sick. That's a good yeah. one. Right? All right. What band and what song okay. was that? I feel like I might know this. Raven, would you Maybe? like to answer your eye? Rage Against the Machine. Rage <laughs> Against the Machine, yes! That's the band, that yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, oh, good for Rage them. Rage Against the Machine. Oh, yeah. uh, of course. Rage Against the Machine with the fucking communist imagery here. Might as well just put a goddamn swastika on the cover of the album. Not down with the communist shit. It's not funny. It's not cute. It's not edgy. Yes! Okay. Oh my god, you're doing Wait, okay. you're a new metalhead. Oh and my god. We're new metal. Oh yeah. We're new metalheads. Woo! I like it. She was a new metalhead this whole time. Certified headbangers. Real rockers. charged band that is, you know, Rage Against the Machine can really only mean one thing. I listen to Rage that. Against the Machine. That's okay. That I know that name. I know. I know that name. I like that. Look, look how... Look how how focused Jackson is. He's like, I can't wait to earn your approval by saying some try hard thing about this band. Come on, daddy, hit me with it so I can try hard to earn your approval. It can really only mean one thing. I listen to Rage that. Against the Machine. That's okay. That I know that name. Be on my play. So <laughs> well done, Jackson. You have my approval. What's the song? I, I just want to say Justified, but I don't I don't really know the name of it. The song is Killing in the Name. Killing in the Name of oh, Boom. 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 <laughs> you. <laughs> I guess, yeah. Apparently. Okay, we got some corn. That was really cool. This is what a cool is video. This? Jackson says, Nani. Oh, it's corn! <laughs> okay, but they, they showed the logo of the band. I feel like that's cheating, but it's okay. Hey, hey, scatting! <laughs> that's... Wow, which, I'm impressed. She actually did a really good job of that. If we need somebody to fill in for Jonathan Davis on the next tour, I think we just uh, found our girl. Okay, how'd you guys uh, get the name of the band? Oh, it just came She's to me. She's just so smart. Yeah. She loves new metal. <laughs> Yeah. New, I like this. I like their representation of new metal fan is uh, to give her scene hair. I like that. Quality rage bait there. Yeah, new metal. <laughs> oh! He scattered so hard he wanted the bullet. That was Dude. crazy. That's right. That song was 
Freak on the Leash by Korn. Wow, that's What'd Freak on the Leash. What you guys think about song? How'd you guys feel about that? That was unexpected. Man. Why? Can you do that speaking oh, in tongues yeah. for us? Uh, what was that? That was a... <clears throat> okay, let's see. <laughs> Prepare your cringe Narcan, people. I feel like this one's going to be rough. You may be at risk of a cringe overdose here, so uh, prepare yourselves accordingly. I mean, not bad, actually. I feel like this girl did a better job, but not bad. The only thing I can think is like... Oh, Jackson, no. Oh, Jackson needs a cringe intervention. Um, I'm sorry, Jackson. He seemed like a nice kid, but... We need an intervention. This is for your sake. Um, you're going to be going away to college soon. And if you want to touch any boobies, which uh, you should, or penises, whichever you're into, I don't care. If you want to touch any parts, we're going to need to have a cringe intervention or it's going to be a very lonely uh, existence for you. Like a That's what he sounds like. What do you mean? <laughs> okay, now we got Limp Bizkit. I love him. <laughs> is it, wow. Is this Wow, she is she is into it. Okay. They're grooving. Look at that grooving. You can't help it. Everybody, everybody grooving when they hear the dirty rotten biscuit. You can't help it. This one's kind of vibey. Like... It's kind of vibey. Oh it's oh my god. Oh look at Jackson doing the whatever this is. It's almost like the Indian head nod. Yeah, like <laughs> stick it up your oh she's like wait when he said stick it up your yeah does it mean your booty is he telling you to stick it up your booty that's not very nice why would you tell somebody to stick it up their booty he's a very iconic artist very, very iconic artist i agree i agree when i think of fred durst the first thing that comes to mind is artist very well known in the 2000s uptime period you guys are from we were little. We were smashed little. Prime Limp Britney Biscuit. Spears. Yeah. Allegedly smashed Prime Christina Aguilera. If Fred Durst did nothing else in his life other than smash Prime Christina, I would say that man deserves a Nobel Prize for that and that alone. That's Limp Biscuit? <laughs> wow, I've never seen yeah. him in my life. You've never looked at him? Oh, God. Did, did you hear that? Limp Listen. Biscuit. Yeah. Bro, that's Limp Biscuit? <laughs> wow, I've never seen yeah. him in my life. You that's Limp Biscuit. I've never seen him in my life. He did it. He did the thing. He called Fred Durst Limp Biscuit. Ah! <laughs> he did the thing. <laughs> Honey, look. It's Limp Biscuit. He's not as tall as I thought he would be. Hey, Limp Biscuit, uh, uh, can you take my picture with Limp Biscuit? I'm a huge fan. Honey, you're never going to believe it. I met Limp Biscuit at the airport, and he was really, really nice. He did it. This man is the goat. He is. You never looked at him? Bro, why would I have looked at Limp Biscuit? You're uh, on the <laughs> Why would I have looked at Limp Biscuit? He did it. Ah, he did it. He called Fred Durst Limp Biscuit. This is the best day of my life. Internet. <laughs> this is Limp Biscuit? And do you know the name of the song? Is it really? Oh. So the song is all about Status Confused right here. Uh, I did it all for the nookie. Yeah, the nookie. Yeah. yeah. So oh, so stick it up your the... yeah. So in oh. your definition I like how confused she is. She seems like deeply confused. Like she just woke up from like anesthesia after surgery. She's like, but oh, where am I? Is this real life? What is a limp biscuit? Sad lumpy. Sad, oh. lo sad oh. lumpy? lumpy? Sad lumpy? I don't know. Sad lumpy. Finish it. Finish it. Help. Well, Please. a limp biscuit. I, I can't say what a limp biscuit actually is or I'll get TOS, but you can look it up. It's very inappropriate that he would ask this girl, what Limp Biscuit means. Let's put it that way. Yeah. Sad lumpy body part. Sad okay. lumpy body part? That's not what yeah, it means. That's, that's sweet. Oh, no, well, it's much worse than that, unfortunately. Body part that's sweet. sweet. Aww. Yes. All right, next song. Okay, really quick. I need uh, to, I need to refuel that. after that. That, that was refuel. Oh, okay. Now we got System of the Down. Oh, I can't wait to hear Jackson's impression of Chop Suey. You know, this is going to be fire. Oh, it's him in a different way. <laughs> so she thinks that uh, John and Serge are the same person, which, listen, that is racial profiling, young lady. Not all Armenians look the same, except for the Armenians in this band who actually do all look the same. So I guess I understand. Dude, he has a Firebird bass. That's yeah. crazy. 
the yellow shirt. Oh, Jackson knows what a Firebird base is. Oh, oh, Jackson. Oh, I'm just, I'm rubbing my head because I'm so, like, how are you 22? You're like physically 22 and mentally like 46. Ah, oh, you shouldn't know what a Firebird base is. And you certainly shouldn't think it's interesting. We need to send you to conversion camp to cleanse you of all your Gen Xisms. That's what I think. Jackson is somehow too old to hang out with me. Exactly. Huh. So we showed Angel that song, right? And uh -huh. she was like, oh, I like this song. I dig it. And then at the very end, they said, when angels deserve to die. And she went, that's me. I hate <laughs> that's this so music. Funny. Good I respect. Oh my. Respect to Angel. Respect. That's Incredible. So, funny. so what song is that? So what you guys? Angels deserve to die. No. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> No. They very, said it's so confident. Very close. <laughs> they said, I like this. This is what my wife would say. She would confidently just say whatever the most used line in the song is. I like that. Let's oh, get still. reaction. So how do you guys feel about that song? The, the changes and weird stuff. That was a classic for sure. What, what's the band? That is System of a Down and the song is Chop Suey. Oh, I yeah. like how he's... <laughs> I like how he's con oh of course of course confidently nodding afterwards there you go but how'd you feel about it what, like in defense of jackson i bet he's actually a really nice kid with good friends i'm sure he's a really nice kid with good friends too my concern is just when he goes off to college in the near future i'm afraid that he is going to end up in a bit of a dry spell because he is mentally 46 years old jackson help me help you okay that's all just help me help you Definitely. yeah jackson's got lots of friends what he doesn't have is a lot of bitches. <laughs> That's the problem. Jackson's the kind of guy that he's going to like um, tell a girl, I love you. And she's going to say, oh my God, Jackson, I love you. I love you so much. I love you too. And he's going to be like, you, you do? And she's like, yes, you are the best friend that I have ever had. And I just don't know how I could ever live without your tender friendship. And I just, I, I can't wait for you to meet my boyfriend because he is going to love you just as much as I do. That's the future for Jackson if he keeps talking about Firebird bases. Uh, that's Chop Suey by System of a Down. That is yeah, correct. I don't want to okay, ruin this friendship, Jackson. You said you actually recognize this song. Yes. How'd you like it? I don't, I don't know where it's from. I think it's good. That was nice. Mm -hmm. That wasn't... Uh, maybe it's that's just all. Listen, familiar, though. Jackson, that's I'm just trying to help you. I love you, buddy. I love you. I'm just trying to help. That's all. I don't want you to ever have to hear that speech. That's all. Are you going to hit it? I need to wait for it. All right. Dun, 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 dun. I love what she just did. She was there like, we here, go. Are they down with the sickness? Oh, <laughs> there we go. Wow, look at that. She did it. She hit the ooh wah ah ah. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Shout out to Angel. These people are, are they called, is it Wicked? What is, no, no. Wicked, that's right. This is Wicked. Good call. I don't know his name. Justin, you nailed it. This is Wicked. No, that's close. Um, that's close. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I want to go to a concert. <laughs> Want to go to a concert. Oh, to go to concert. I like that. If somebody refers to it as a concert, this is somebody you want in your life because this means uh, if they call it a gig, that means there's some like loser Gen X punk person. You definitely don't want them in your life. If they call it a show, they might be into like hardcore, which means they're definitely like a mentally unstable, dysfunctional person. Concert is what you want. Like, honey, do you want to go to the uh, the Bad Bunny concert this weekend? Anybody want to go to the Bad Bunny concert? Those are the kind of people that you want in your life. People who say concert. New metal concert? Yeah. I'll take you to one. Oh, really? Yeah. It's stuck in my throat, really. <laughs> <laughs> That's an iconic song. Yeah. I don't know why I know it. This would, this is such a good mosh it's, it's song. Used, it's used in... Oh, she said it's such a good mosh song. I like it. Memes all the time. Yes, this, that sound. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's it is perfect. a good mosh oh, song. Oh, Disturbed. Disturbed. There we go. That mm -hmm. is Disturbed down with the sickness that we just listened to. If this was a quiz, I'd be losing. That's good. She said, if this was a quiz, I'd be losing. This is a quiz that you should want to lose. <laughs> Give yourself a pat on the back for that. Ah, 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 ah. Yeah. Andrew, play oh, that meme. Ah, ah. <laughs> That's what he, that was great. All right, Jackson, are you ready to hit this? Ooh, ah, ah. But no, no, no. Yeah. Angel, you ready as well? Oh, Help no. Me. Oh, no. Oh, no. Everybody, prepare your cringe Narcan. Here it comes. Need a Angel, uh, I want you to help me in judging his ooh, ah, ah. Okay. All right. <laughs> get into character. Be think. How do I get down with the sickness? Down with the sickness. All right, here we go. Oh. Yeah, well, down with the sickness. I'm trying to... Uh, Jackson, what did we talk about? Just prepare yourself to hear the speech about how you're the greatest friend and I love you so much because I don't want to ruin what we have and I just don't think of you that way. You're going to make some girl so happy someday 
but that girl is not me. Just prepare yourself to hear that speech. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> so my crystal ball is showing. <laughs> yeah, worse than Scott's tots. Just for you. <laughs> you know what's even worse than Scott's tots is, uh, what is it, date Mike? Date night Mike? That's worse by far <laughs> than Scott's tots. This is worse than both of them combined. Got my life into pieces. Now we got some pop This roads. is my last resort. No oh. breathing. Don't Jackson I going off. Now, Jackson, you just said a swear, and you know the rules. If you say a swear, no more iPad for the rest of the week. Okay, buddy? We talked about this. No more swears. I'm surprised he let himself do that. I feel like Jackson would be the kind of guy that doesn't swear. So many white kids who don't feel like they're a part of their town. <laughs> oh, hey, girl. <laughs> Wait, that was such a cool song. This is a good song. No. Great drum sound. Ugh. <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry, Jackson. I'm sorry. You seem like a really nice person. I'm sorry to beat you up here, but this is this is rough right here. If they ever bring the office, like wait 20 years, if they ever bring the office back, I feel like he has a future being Michael Scott in the uh, 2065 reboot of The Office. Yeah. I love it. He's on stuff here like this right now. You know what's funny? Every single person in here could also be in the same era anti-drug ad. It's so good. <laughs> That's true. It was like, it was cutting back and forth between the band like rocking out and then it was like really sad. Too. The band Funniest rocking out. Funniest thing is she's just she's like, like, she's, she's like in the middle. Hey, well, listen, this is what happens when you listen to new metal. Before she heard Papa Roach, she was uh, head of the cheerleading team. She was valedictorian of her class. She was popular. She got straight A's. And then one note of new metal turned her into this. Sitting on her desk, clutching her knees against her body, you know, dark, the, the, the raccoon eyeliner. This is what new metal does to you people, okay? So new metal, not even once. This is your brain on new metal. And uh, my friends, I can't even make it through the rest of this video. I've already almost overdosed on cringe. So I'm gonna wrap it up for now. This is Gen Z reacting to 90s new metal and uh listen jackson if you see this just i'm just a dm away help me help you buddy help me help you that's that's all i'm saying just let us save you from the friend zone trust me i can tell you from experience it's a dark place you don't want to go there so there it is people gen z reacting to 90s new metal there it is how dare you call them the transformers band Ugh!